Okay, this is how you can add a site to Google Webmaster Tools. Okay, so um, this is, I'm going to do this on a, a site. It's actually a MemberGate site, but you can do this on any site, really, a blog or whatever you've got. I'm choosing a MemberGate site because that's the site that I'm happy to be adding right now. So um, this is my dashboard for Google Webmaster Tools. If you don't have an account, you need to set up a Google account. It's the usual process. Um, set up a Google account, then you can log into Google Webmaster Tools. Okay, so from the dashboard here, I'll click Add Site, and I'm going to enter the URL. And I'm going to click continue. Okay, and it says not verified meta tag. I'm going to choose to upload an HTML file. Okay, and I'll select I'll verify later. Okay, now if I go back to this site, I'm going to put click verify this site. And again, upload an HTML file. And it's giving me the option here to download a file now. It's telling me to download this file. It never used to do this, but now it says download. Um, and once you've uploaded, you better click on this link. So I'm just going to click that file to download. Um, I've got it in, I'm going to actually just save the file straight to my desktop. Okay, now I'm going to go into the site for this. Now, uh, this might be very different. I'm using Membergate. Membergate has a control panel function where I can upload files directly to it. Um, if you're not, if you don't have Membergate, you'll have to FTP the file manually up to your site. Okay, so um, we'll cover FTP and stuff in another tutorial, but this is, I'm doing this directly through the site. I think with um, with WordPress or something like that, I can probably upload as well directly from the WordPress control panel. I'm, actually, I might correct myself there. I don't think I can do it in WordPress, but anyway, I'm doing it in Membergate, so I'm logged into the Membergate control panel here, and I'm just going to choose the file upload feature um, on the left-hand side, and I'm going to select the file to upload from my desktop and it was called Google something so I'll just put in G O I think that's the file there so I'll just click open I'm gonna double check if I go back to Google here you go that ends in the same numbers it ends in six three two eight seven if I go back here and just six three two eight seven so I know it's the same file this is the file I've selected and anyway, I'm now going to choose to upload it just to the root directory because it says here, when I click on this, there's no other, see this forward slash here, there's no other folders after that, so it's into the root directory. Um, so I'll just do that. It's already selected as a root folder, so I'll just click Upload File. And then what I'll do is I'll just click this link here, because Membergate provides, me um, provides me a link afterwards after I've uploaded the file, so I'm just going to click on that. And there's the file. This is the file that Google have given me um, and it, I know it's ready and installed on the site. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to go back to Google Webmaster Tools and from here I'm going to actually click on the link that they provide. Okay, This is the link that Google are providing me. I'm going to click on it and I get the same file again, right? So that's telling me it's all working. So now what I'll do is I'll click Verify And that's it all set. I now know that Google have verified. They show me the dashboard, and they've already bring it, bringing up um, keywords and things. So what I'm going to do from here, I'm actually going to click back to home, and it shows me here that the site's verified, and it's showing you www. And I can gain, I can click on that, and it's all set. So that tells me it's all verified and ready to go. Um, I uploaded the file just as they um, told me to do. Um, and I can now start tracking all my keywords and everything through Google Webmaster Tools, okay? <laughs>